We have a lot of eyes in the house. I know we're down here at Rui Pui. Big Ten in the house, all right. <laughs> all right, Jadis is one of these athletes that's just so phenomenal. I'm not going to just do all the accolades, but I do want to mention one thing. She is going into the Olympic Hall of Fame for her accomplishments in Paralympic sports competition. One, one cool thing about Jane, and uh, before I want to tell a story a little bit to y'all, is that she just had a cruise ship named after her. Tell us a little bit about that uh, cruise ship. You know, where can we get, get a ride on that boat? Well, it's not actually named after me. I'm a godmother of the cruise ship. Every cruise ship that sails, actually every ship that sails on this thing has a godmother. And so uh, Royal Caribbean was naming female Olympic athletes as godmothers of their larger class series and stuff. Jackie Jordan Kersey, Harvey Levitt, Stephanie Graff, uh, and myself are, are godmothers of the ship. Uh, that's pretty cool, right? The godmother. It's like the godfather, but this is mother, right? <laughs> so the reason why she's like a godmother for the ship is because she has done such phenomenal work with women in sports. So a lot of these young ladies that are out there competing, she just had a phenomenal role, she's been a phenomenal role model with this, and they're doing some great things around the world. Why don't you tell the audience a little bit about what's happened with Title IX and also what happened with, uh, with our Paralympic athletes with women in sport? Well, actually, I'm a, a beneficiary of Title IX. Um, I went to the University of Illinois as a, a freshman and um, had amazing coaching, competed in four Paralympic games, um, and then had an opportunity to, uh, to give back and to help with wheelchair track camps around the world. I've done a lot of work in Ghana, West Africa, and um, because of it, Ghana is now sending athletes to the Paralympic Games, and that is almost as great as uh, winning medals. Outstanding. So I can't name all your accomplishments. I just know that we were teammates in 2000, the Paralympic Games, and then also 96. But why don't you just, you know, toot your own home a little bit. Tell everybody what your accomplishments are, because I, I just don't know everything. I mean, I, I, you've got like four jumps in, a gazillion, right? So. I didn't have that I've got 12 Paralympic medals, um, five gold, silver, four bronze. Um, the Olympic Games, they have two wheelchair exhibition events, one for men and one for women, from uh, 1984 to 2004. And so I competed in the Olympic, Women's Up Olympic exhibition event in 92, 96, and won silver medals those years. Uh, probably my biggest claim to fame is that I won the Boston Marathon eight times and broke the world record five times in those eight times. She's amazing, right? Awesome. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the lovely Jean Driscoll. Please stop her, chat her up, you know, because she's, she's just awesome, loves, loves to talk, and uh, really inspire each and every person that's out there, especially young ladies. So, so she's going to be uh, walking around, just, just catch her attention, get an autograph. Thanks, Jean.